nothing did go as planned today, I can tell you that, because I am in a windy and rainy I am actually in uh, Verona now at the train station about to change trains because I am going up to Munich now and uh, I have actually decided to uh, travel home to Sweden now and uh, I will do a few stops along the way but it is um, going to be a short stop so I'm just going to stay at hotels in Munich, Hamburg and Copenhagen and then travel on the trains at date times. Sorry for the uh, road traffic noises that is going on here. It's a big road outside of my hotel. And I'm about to check in at this hotel, Hyperion Hotel. It's a five-star hotel and I actually um, got another room in um, another hotel and uh, I cancelled it because I did find a room for the same price in this five-star hotel instead. So I decided to take that instead. So uh, let's go in and see how it is. In the hotel room now at floor 11. So let's just uh, have a look around. I mean uh, this is the most luxurious room that I have had this far. And it's free quality coffee include the two also now it's time for the view i mean it's not too bad all right let's just chill for an hour or so until the restaurant opens So I am actually in Hamburg now. I got out of Hamburg yesterday from München. Only slept here in Hamburg one night. But here's the I'm going to Copenhagen and I'm going to change trains in Flensburg and in Fredericia in Denmark. But we should have departed Hamburg main station 30 minutes ago and we haven't moved an inch since that. And all I can understand from the call out, I have studied the German, so I understand some German, is that we do have some technical problems with the train, 
I actually had to disembark the train and I'm going to take the next train to Flensburg. But this is turning out to be sort of a uh, adventure now because uh, that only leaves me with uh, six minutes to change trains in Flensburg. So uh, we'll see how it goes. So uh, I made it to Copenhagen. Uh, a little bit late and uh, I literally had just 30 seconds to get to my connection in Flensburg but I made it unfortunately that train was also late so I missed my connection in Fredericia in Denmark so I had to take another train but I got here in Copenhagen behind me is the Copenhagen Central Station I am minutes have uh, been touching Swedish soil again for the first time in a couple of weeks and it was wonderful. And by the way, here comes my train to Malmö. Nothing did go as planned today, I can tell you that, because I am in a windy and rainy Stockholm and um, Let's just say it like this, my train to Umeå was cancelled and th there was no alternative traffic. There is no trains, there is no buses, there is no airplanes. As you can see I am in a hotel room. Just like 15 minutes prior to our arrival in Stockholm we got a message that uh, our next train to Umeå, which is like a six and a half or seven hour long train is completely cancelled. The National Railway Company of Sweden was not able to find any other uh, trains or buses because of, of the weather and flooding in Sweden. So they literally told us to find our own connections. I, of course, immediately started to search for Another ticket, it was completely sold out for the next trains. The only ticket I found was a first class ticket that leaves 6.21 tomorrow morning, if it leaves. <laughs> and I'm not in a good mood. I just really want to get home now. Good morning to you all. It's very early in the morning and uh, I am going to check out from this hotel now. And I need to go exactly now to check out because my train leaves in 30 minutes. So I am back home in Umeå now, we were about an hour later to train from Stockholm and I was almost half a day late from, or actually more than half a day late from Stockholm because I was scheduled to take the earlier train yesterday. Uh, but anyway it was great to be back home in Umeå and I was away for 27 days and it feels amazing that I did this journey with my diagnosis that I have. It's been tough sometimes, but it's also been very, very fun. My tomato plant has really gone wild since I was away. And uh, with that said, I think it's time to end this vlog and see you later.